What's going on, Switch? This is Shimi Sif here, and welcome to Disney Infinity! <laughs> welcome to this little mini series I'm going to be doing with you guys where you and me are going to be building a world in the toy box mode. So, I'm going to be playing today with Captain Jack Sparrow. Of course, I have, uh, if you saw the unboxing, I also have Sully and Mr. Incredible and Mater from Cars. So, we might be messing around with some of those guys in a little bit. But um, basically, what you see here is a world that I have created on my own. Uh, this is just a couple things I was messing around with last night. Um, and I want to just do a couple episodes where, where I build something for you guys and then hopefully uh, can just upload this to the sort of the Disney Infinity Online servers. And uh, you guys can play in it and create in it um, as you wish as well. So I am uh, I'm actually going to, to jump up here and show you guys sort of what I've built so far. So. Um, if, if something sounds different, uh, let me just start by saying if something sounds different, I am actually using my old microphone. Um, I couldn't really detach the other one from my main computer and I'm recording in my living room now because mm -hmm. I'm playing on my TV because I'm playing on the Wii U, which is awesome. So, um, anyway, so this is my world. Uh, this is basically all I've done so far is just, I put some hedge bushes down and, um, actually let me give you guys a better view here. Now, because the Wii U has a gamepad, um, I'm going to go ahead and switch this over to play on TV mode. And that way, when I go to the actual build mode, it's going to... What you guys are going to see is going to be different. Um, on my gamepad, I have the, the pick a toy list. But if I just go ahead and pay no attention to the item I'm moving around, pay all the attention in the world to what I've built so far. Um, and, uh, yeah, this is pretty much it. Now, when I am building, I'm going to be using a different mode so that you guys can sort of see what is uh, the items that I am choosing and the items that I have at my disposal, and the, or the toys, I guess they're called. Um, and that way I also can hear the music and all the sounds because I have my headset plugged into the gamepad, which is pretty sweet. Um, but as of right now, I'm too far from the TV and my headset doesn't reach. But anyways, this is the world that I've built so far. I was thinking that it'd be really fun to maybe build some sort of a racetrack today. Uh, I've already sort of started here a little bit, but... Um, it was really, I was just sort of messing around last night and uh, I made the racetrack go over here and then it goes like through the windmill as you can see. So I don't know, I'll just give you guys a quick run through of what I've already what I've already built. But as you can see, we have all this land mass out here that I've already pre, like basically pre-built and pre-laid down that um, we can just, I'll just build sort of with you guys together, I guess. So uh, let's go ahead, I'm gonna hit start here and I'm gonna bring the play on gamepad button back up. Doesn't look like any difference to you guys, but on the gamepad, I can see some stuff now. So, let me uh, let me give you guys a quick little rundown here with oh Captain Jack. And you have to forgive me, I'm still getting used to the controls a bit. So there may be times where I do some silly stuff that you're like, what is he doing? Um, but yeah, so anyways, I'm really, really charmed and intrigued by this game. Uh, it's, it's quite fun. Oh, I could have taken the attack. Ah, let's do it. I'm going to take the attack helicopter out for a spin. I'll show you guys that way. So let's go ahead and hop in. And I'm spitting all over the gamepad as I'm commentating. All right, so these controls are a bit funny. We gotta go up with the right stick to fly around. And, oops, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's do this, and yes, the right trigger, ZR, actually makes us go forward. So this is my world, as you guys can see here. This would have been a much better way to show off, show off my world than, than what I did before. Over here, behind this, this hedge bush, we have, uh, oh gosh, this is hard to control. We have, <laughs> stop moving. Okay, right here is a uh, an enemy spawner. So occasionally I might get shot at by enemies and fun stuff like that. Oh my gosh, I can't control this. Okay, it takes a bit of used to. I got really used to it last night and then apparently my brain decided to forget everything on how to fly this while I was sleeping, which is cool. Um, but one thing I want to do for you guys today before we get started building is I do need to switch the sky because the sky mode right now it's nighttime and I'm assuming I'll probably be uploading this during the daytime so let's make this daytime hooray sunlight comes out the stars should fade away wait they not oh maybe this is a different sky hold on let's try this what is this gonna give us oh no that's gonna give us the uh, the nighttime well I do have a power disc uh, the Cinderella's cow Castle, or not Cinderella's Castle. I have Alice in Wonderland. I'm gonna put that on the gamepad right now. There we go. And now it looks like Alice in Wonderland. That's pretty cool. 
<laughs> this game is so awesome. Oh, it's just so charming. Let's see if we can make it actual daytime, though. That might be kind of fun. So, whoa! It's like night! For real! Set out and see what's beyond the horizon. Come on! Recharge! There we go. Wow, the sun completely set on us there. Hmm. Give me daylight! Oh, yeah, there we go. Do it now, do it now, do it now. It was doing it last night, I swear. It was like cycling between the three. I don't know what it's doing right now. Am I doing something wrong? Well, if we have to go with Alice in Wonderland, that won't be the worst thing ever. Okay, this was daytime. I don't know why. I just thought that, that since I could still see the, the stars and everything. But in any case, enough of this. Let's get building on our racetrack. Oh, yes. So I wanted to show you guys. Let me go find my... My vehicle of choice. Where is the stunt buggy? Ah, here it is. This is awesome. Get on in there. All right. So let's drive out here. Oh no! Drive out here. Here we go. So this is what I've built so far. Oh geez, somebody's shooting at me, and I'm, I can't steer. It's kind of. It is kind of hard to steer at some time. Sometimes it depends on what car you're in. And then I've got into there. That's it. That's all I've got. So I think what we need to do, oops, wrong button, is start building today. So let's do this. So we're going to go into build mode. And now you guys can see all the blocks that I have unlocked and are at my disposal here. Now you do start with certain packs, uh, but the more you play and the more mini games you play and the more parts of the story that you do play, in fact, uh, you get these things that allow you to um, roll. Uh, you go to the spinner. Here, I'll show you guys real fast because I'm sure a lot of you guys, um, it's a brand new game. Well, fairly new. It came out like a week ago. But if you come over here, I'm sure some of you want to see this. I unfortunately have no spins available, but if I did, there would be a whole bunch of toys there that I could spin from and uh, could uh, get some new stuff. So let's go back to build mode here. And I am going to, let's see here. Oh man, I don't know what I want. Maybe I should go back to the other mode. Wait, let's go to, let's go to build view. Oh, here we go. This is what I was looking for. Yes. Perfect. Okay. So, what I'm thinking we should do here for this racetrack is... Let's see. I need to pick a piece that is going to... Uh, let's see. Let's pick a piece that is going to go... I can't... Okay. I can't do that... I see. I see the dilemma. So I can't put anything through the um, the windmill here. So what I'm gonna have to do is we're gonna have to drop this a bit, and I want to make like a jump. That could be really awesome. Oh no, wait! I have I have objects in the way. Okay, so to move these objects, I'm gonna go out of this mode. We're gonna go to Jack Sparrow, Captain Jack, and let's select the magic wand. And if I come over here, so the one item that looked like it was sort of in my way was the slingshot thingy over here that I placed last night just for fun. If I go ahead and select this, so let's select that, move on to there. Oh, right there, right there, right there. All right, if I press B, then I should be able to move this, move this around. And I'm going to move this to, say, here. So let's put that out of the way uh, of where we want to build. Now, I want to build, let's see. My oh wait, action toys. No, I don't want action toys. I want not enemies. I want is it blocks? Are they still in here? Oh no, 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 they're not. Track pieces. There we go. All right. So awesome. So now let's go ahead. Make sure this is lined up. And I want to make a track piece like this. Um, oops, let's move it out this way a bit and move it up. Yes, so we're gonna have ourselves like a jump right here. And actually what I wanna do, I'm gonna make a short track piece and we're gonna put this right here. Now watch. So now what I wanna do is go to, I need a ramp. Where are the ramps? They're right here. Yes, 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 yes. Here we go. Okay, cool. So now we're going to build this guy. And then let's do... 
Actually, hold on. Did I want to do that? No. I want to do... Oh yeah, that's probably better. That's probably a much more gradual curve there. So actually, I can't place that there because... Oh shoot, that dungeon thing is in the way. We're gonna make this work, I promise. All right, so let's see if we can get ourselves a short turn. Fit that into here somewhere. Basically what I'm trying to do at this point is make this track continue on um, within the, the world that I've already created. Nope, that's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. I may be out of luck here. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna actually go... So let's get Captain Jack. Let's have him delete some track pieces for us. All right. So I'm gonna actually... We're gonna redesign this completely. Oh, snap! You stop that! All right, got him. And I gotta collect those little sparks things. That's how you, you level up, and that's how you get more of those... Uh, the ability to spin. Uh, all right, where's my elevator? I gotta get to my elevator. It's over here. The music is awesome in this game. I love this music. All right, take me to the tops of the hedge bushes where no pirate should be allowed to go. All right, so now up here, now that I have a view of all... Oh, no! No! I would do that. Oh, dang it. We're gonna delete those track pieces up there, though. We're gonna make this... A little bit more, uh, I don't know. I'm gonna make it cool. So let's do this. Go up here. Let's try this again, Captain Jack. Let's try this again. All right. Do this. I was never good at platforming games. Which is what I feel like I'm doing right now. Okay. So delete. Let's go ahead and delete. Delete. And yes, I think this will be good. So let's go back to build mode. And I think what I'd like to do here. Oh, I like this song a lot. This is a cool song. Let's do a track piece like this. Oh, I gotta raise this up. Oops. Let's go like that. Oh, is that seriously still in the way? No! What to do, what to do. I'd have loved to make a, made a loop here. That's probably still in the way too, huh? Shucks! Stupid windmill. I really like the windmill there, to be honest. Okay. What if we did something like this? Yeah, here we go. Oh, wait, you guys still can't do this. I am bad at this. Alright, so that can be built there, but on that side, but not on the other side. Can I move it over? No. Um, okay, so what we're going to obviously have to do, once again, go back to my deleting friend, Captain Jack himself. We're going to have to delete this guy. I didn't plan on this, um, having these many problems for our racetrack. But I guess that's uh, that's what you have to deal with sometimes. So let's go ahead and bring this guy over here. Boom. Does that line up? Nope. We got to move it over just a bit. Come on. There we go. And then let's see. Bring it, let's bring it down. All right. So let's do, let's do one of these. Flip this around. Oops. There we go. There we go. Now building is easier. Oh wait, I should have probably done... 
No, I want this. I want this ramp to be very wavy. That'd be cool. Wavy ramps for the win. All right, so let's move this guy over here. And one thing I do want to do to avoid um, like falling off and stuff when you're racing. Um, I think that connects. Does that connect right? Yeah, I want to put. Um, Oh my gosh, that ramp looks so weird. It's all bumpy. <laughs> That's cool. Um, so one thing I do want to do is uh, I need to make a yeah, terrain. So I want to grab the... Um, I guess... Terrain blocks. Yeah. I'm going to lower these down. And that way, we've got a little bit of terrain over here. Oh, hold on. Do that. There we go. For our racetrack. Um, not necessarily specifically for like that piece, but we do have one of those guys in the way. How far out does this go? Let's see. I'm gonna have to move that cliff. I think that saves enough room. Although I should honestly move that first before I do anything. Jack! Nope. There we go. Come on, select that guy right there. Right there. There we go. Okay. Now we get to move this guy. I'm going to move this guy down the way a little bit. Alright, cool. So... Now I want to go back to... Where are my terrain blocks? Here they are. Perfect. Oops. What happened there? Alright, let's go over here. There we go. And this way, because part of our track was hanging over the ledge there, um, it won't be so, so risky. Oh my gosh, am I going to need to move this again? Dang it. Come on, Captain. Alright. I hope you guys can hear me well enough. My uh microphone is fairly far away from my my mouth. And it's not my, the best mic I have, obviously. Alright, let's move it. Let's move you again. Grab our terrain block again. Wherever that is. Ooh, I want to put a pond in so bad. Yes. I'm just going to do that here. I don't care if it looks bad. I'll mess with it later. Before I upload this online, I'll make it look very pretty if it doesn't by the end of this little mini-series. I promise. Alright, there we go. Is there no water in there? Okay, so as you can see, oh yeah, there is water in there, perfect. So this is still like, I'll still have to work with the train and whatnot, but now we have our, um, our track is, is, uh, is coming, coming together a bit. Uh, I'm gonna head back to grab that car, cause I wanna test it out. Not like for speed or anything, it's not a complete track by any stretch of the imagination, but I just wanna get Captain Jack over there so that I can edit a bit easier. I think there there are there is another way to edit. Um, where did I leave that car? We can take the Autopia car. That one's fun. Uh, there is another way to edit, but I forget how to get into that menu. All right, dude. Let's drive. Woo. There we go. To make your car go. Oh, that's right. I wanted to. No. I wanted to go over here and just drive our little course. Hey! No! Don't you dare throw stuff at me. Woo! Okay, here we go. They're shooting. They're shooting stuff at me. This car is a lot more controllable because it's not as fast. Oh, dude, that bridge is awesome. 
Oops. Actually, I meant to do that. Okay, so this is where we have our track now. Oh, are you gonna are you gonna fight me? Yes, you get out of here, little broom. All right, so let's go back to build mode. And I want to go to. No, uh, set. There we go. Track pieces. All right, so let's make um. Let's make a uh, straightaway right here. I want to get a long, a very long racetrack piece. Oops. All right, make sure that's on the ground. Yeah. So we'll make a nice straightaway here for all you speed demons out there that want to race. Because I I know that when I play racing games, which this uh, Disney Infinity actually has some racing modes, which are really, really fun, um, that I know that because I'm such a speed demon sometimes when it comes to racing games, I get really excited about a, like a course that has a really long straightaway. And this, this is going to be a straightaway to remember. Look at this. But you thought it would end back there. No, no. Now it's going to end. So we're going to do a big, oh wait, let's do a short, short curve. So don't come into this turn too fast. Otherwise, you're going to get punished. So let's do that and then I think I want to put in one of these pieces these are kind of cool so let me swing around over here and that guy there and I think what I'd like to do here for this section of our track is we're gonna make this go we're gonna make this go up and maybe loop around over over top of the other guy or of the other track that we just built now I'm sure there are more track pieces I can unlock um, but uh, for right now I don't have any track pieces that like curve while going down or uh, or curve while going up or vice versa or whatever um, I wish I did I wish I did. That would be really cool. But I don't, unfortunately. And I'm going to make this actually... I think I'm going to make this really high. So let's go up here. Oops. Oh, this could be a really cool idea. Hold on. Let's go up like this. We'll go up one more. And then we'll flip it. Watch this. We'll flip it. And it'll just be like this point in the sky. This is gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a crazy track. And no, I do not consider myself to be a track building pro by any stretch of the imagination. Although I am trying to stretch my imagination here, which would be really, which is what this game is all about. Oh wait, what is this piece? Uh, oh, long racetrack ramp. Okay. So right here we need a curve. And I realize I'm not putting any supports here yet. I will. There's some supports. You can see those green things on the right side of the screen there. Um, I don't know if those are supports, like, specifically. But uh, I was using them as supports because they looked cool. So I'll, uh, I'll add some of that stuff in, too, maybe next episode if you guys want to see some more of this. I would love to do some Disney Infinity Toy Box videos for you guys. Um, really enjoying this game. Let's do another one of these guys. And then we'll go. I'll be nice and we'll bring it down again. So let's do that. Um, oops, hold on. Here. Like that. Oops. I keep wanting to try and press different buttons for different things, and it's not working out for me right now. All right. So we're not going to go all the way down to the ground. Let's see what other pieces I have at my disposal here. Arched. Oh, no. I already used that. So I only have these turns, huh? That's the only way we're going to be able to vary this up. Hmm. 
I don't know what I want to do. Maybe bring it back like this. Perhaps. Perhaps this could be quite cool. Right, let's do... Oops. Something like that. Now, what I want to know, what I want to find out, and we're going to go back to Captain Jack in our car, our test car. Oh, you stopped! Is, uh... I'm going to jump in here and see if this is... A safe driving height. Yes, it looks like it's be just fine. I think I'll be able to... Yeah. I was going to make sure that the cars would fit under there. Oh, this straightaway is awesome. It's so long. <laughs> Woo! But make sure you get this turn right if you're in a fast vehicle. Or you can drift. And then boost. Oh my gosh, this is nuts. Oh, but this car is chugging. The, the other car wouldn't. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh no, make this turn. Woo! This is pretty cool, actually. And then we reached the end. Oh man, I fell off. All right, actually, where's that other car? I wanna, I wanna grab that other car. Where is it? Oh no, it ran, ran over the tree. Uh, here it is, back here. Oops, wrong button. All right, so this car is the, it's like the off-road vehicle or something. Off-road stunt. Stunt car, and this guy's really fast, and I have trouble controlling it. All right, so I'm gonna end this episode here for today, but let's start at the beginning of our track, and here we go. We'll just test this out and see if this works for us. Oh man! Oh no no! <laughs> I would do that. I would do that. I would be the one guy that does that. No, you stop shooting paintballs at me, you jerk run you over. Grand Theft Auto style. Okay, here we go. So let's try this again. Don't drift around this turn here. It's not worth it. Alright. This beautiful, beautiful track. This crazy track. Oh, look, Mono Road. Oh, I guess you get that achievement if you, um, you catch some air. Like this. Woo! Trick City! That part right there will be cool. You can. Well, I might put like a uh, fence there so you can't actually drive off the road. Dude, this is gonna be sick! Oh man, even this car like feels like it's chugging when it goes up. Woo! Catching a little air there. Oh no, no, no! <laughs> oh! Don't drift that turn either. I wanna get to the end. I wanna get to the end. That's lap punishment right there, my friends. You gotta use a boost to catch up. That right there is a driftable turn. Definitely boost up this straightaway here. Or over that area there and you can get some sick air. Okay, I don't want to mess this turn up. Because I already did that. Oh, this is hard up here. I'm going to have to put some railings or something. No! I'm so bad! I'm seriously so... <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm going to take the shortcut right here. I'm going to make a legit racetrack though, so you can't cut corners like that when it's a fully, fully functional racetrack. But being up in the sky like this, I definitely need like barriers so you can't fall off quite as easily. This is so raw right now that like I am just totally failing. I mean, look, look who's driving it. This guy, Captain Jack, he's made to be a pirate. He's made to, to, to operate ships. There we go. He's made to operate ships, not off-road buggies. So don't blame him. Don't blame him and don't me blame me for my bad driving. So we're gonna end it uh, while we uh, do some awesome donuts here. Let's go out here where it's a little bit more wide open. But thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see some more, uh, hit that like button down below and let me know if you guys want to see some stuff. If you got any ideas of stuff that you want to see me build or whatever, hit me up in the comment section. Woo! And let me know. And uh, hopefully by the end of this little series, we can maybe have um, a pretty cool racetrack. That's if I... I've been having trouble connecting my uh, account or connecting to my account through like the Wii U or whatever. I don't know why. Every time I do it, it keeps saying that um, the service is unavailable at the moment or something. So I'm not really sure, but I'm hoping that by the end of this series, I can resolve it or it will get resolved somehow or whatever. And I'll be able to upload this world for you guys, this official Swifter world as I'm gonna call it. And uh, woo! And uh, yeah, it should be fun, should be a fun time. Let's get some air. 
Oh, yes! And because I'm skilled, I can go backwards on the track. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> oh, no! Uh, yes. <laughs> Alright, so just, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this Disney Infinity uh, little toy box video. If you guys want to see more, like I said, be sure to let me know. And I'll see you guys, hopefully, in the next episode. Peace!